Uh, revolutionary greetings, comrades. We wish you a happy 2023 as the Mabuto Mapena talk show. We will continue our best to give you credible information. We do not want to mislead people that are following this YouTube channel, be it on documentation which affects a, a number of migrants across the globe, uh, be it issues relating to politics. We want to give you a, a fair analysis and the accurate information. We will try our level best. We do not want to mislead any of you. Uh, uh, we know that uh, uh, it's uh, the year where the grace period for the workers of Zimbabwean origin, why in South Africa will have their grace period expiring on the 30th of June 2023. We have been uh, having a discussion on these issues, documentation, how to apply for a permit, the waiver issues and so on. So we'll continue looking into those uh, during the course of this year. We will, of course, be talking about the elections that are going to be taking place in Africa in a number of countries. We will, in the next video, give you a breakdown of a number of countries that are going to have elections in 2023. And we'll try our level best to analyze uh, the elections. We are told by economists that 2023 is going to be a difficult year to most of the workers. Uh, we are told that there is going to be a global recession. Uh, this, of course, calls on all of us as workers to rethink on our, <clears throat> on our expenditure uh, because we need to cut down on, on our budgets uh, uh, because we are told it's going to be a really difficult year. Uh, we still have a war in the Eastern Europe. So a global recession, the war in Ukraine, uh, uh, we are still recovering from COVID-19. So it's going to be difficult for the workers. But of course, we, we will be discussing, we'll be discussing with the economists uh, in 2023 as part of advising workers on, uh, on their financial uh, spending. Uh, uh, we have seen uh, some workers who will, spare, will buy uh, expensive things. For instance, a worker will buy an expensive motor vehicle, which is expensive to maintain. Uh, you buy an X5, yes, it is good to drive that expensive vehicle, an X5, but think of the service, the tires to maintain the vehicle, uh, of which you can buy a cheaper vehicle to maintain, which is not expensive of, or, on fuel. Uh, but, but what, of course, is of concern, which we will be discussing in this channel, is that uh, some workers prefer to invest, uh, maybe it's peer pressure, which we have to discuss. Uh, they want to invest on motor vehicles uh, as opposed to real estate. Uh, and I have seen particularly migrant workers you stay in an apartment in Hebrew, which, which you are renting, you have been staying there for 20 years, but you own three motor vehicles because you want your peers to see you driving a, a most expensive vehicle uh, in Hebrew. So these are some of the issues that uh, we will be discussing, uh, inviting economists to our this channel so that they give tips on how to spend as workers. Uh, the other issue that uh, this channel we want to focus on in 2023, it's the happy families. Uh, as workers, we are stressed at the workplace. Uh, we are abused by our employers. Uh, when we go home, in the few hours that we are home, <clears throat> we want to rest, we want to relax. Uh, uh, but uh, we then, uh, uh, some workers uh, find a hope, not a conducive environment because there are issues of domestic violence. Women have been abused, uh, men have been abused in relationships. These are some of the issues that uh, we are going to be speaking about in this channel, Happy Families, uh, uh, so that um, as workers we build Happy Families. Uh, we will, of course, uh, uh, be discussing in detail uh, the issues relating to the Zimbabwean elections, the position of the Zimbabwe Communist Party, uh, uh, what uh, the working class and peasants in Zimbabwe expect and uh, what we think should be done. We will be discussing uh, uh, the ZCP uh, political and economic program on how we think we can rebuild the Zimbabwean economy. So please share your views on issues that uh, you want this channel to discuss. We know there's a comrade that uh, had asked us to do a video on uh, dual citizenship. He asked us a question. We are yet to finalize our research on that because, like I'm saying, we do not want to mislead 
we want to give credible information but we'll continue as, as, as the Zimbabwe community in South Africa uh, to work with the traditional leaders in South Africa to work with the political parties, progressive political parties, civil society in trying to find a solution to the issues that affect uh, um, migrants in South Africa. You know that as the Zimbabwe community in South Africa, we affiliate to the African Diaspora Forum. So the African Diaspora Forum has all these uh, uh, commissions that we'll be speaking to uh, in the course of the year. We'll be having a strategic meeting soon, uh, end of January, where we'll be rolling out uh, the program of the African Diaspora Forum in terms of uh, the work that, that, that we do. Uh, so we hope that again in this channel uh, is going to be an interesting discussion that, that will be taking place in this channel. We certainly value your contributions and want to thank you for all the comments that uh, you have been writing in 2022. We hope you are going to continue in 2023. Otherwise, I uh, want to wish you a happy new year, notwithstanding the challenges that I've already spoken about that uh, you are likely to have a global uh, recession. But we wish you good health, we wish you good life, we wish you all the happiness and our condolences to those workers uh, that lost their loved ones during the festive season. Otherwise, we love you all. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel, circulate this video, and like it. Goodbye.